Hey everyone, this is Alicia from Buckle Up with Blackmore. I am just going to give a demonstration on how to adjust the headrest and the harness on a Baby Love Easy Grow. This seat is similar to others on the market, such as the Baby Love Easy Grow 2, the Safe and Sound Atlas Grow, and the Safe and Sound Urban Grow 2. Um, there are also other seats with a similar mechanism um, that are in a zero to four years range. They would be the Safe and Sound Safe Fix, Premier, Easy Switch EP, the Baby Love Safe Keeper 2, and Easy Fix. For this demonstration, I'm going to move the harness up one slot. This means that this headrest is going to have to go up. If you want to move the harness down, you will need to move the headrest down too. Start out by loosening the harness as much as you can by lifting or pressing the button and pulling on the shoulder portion of the harness. Turn the seat around so you can see the metal splitter plate on the back of the seat. The headrest can be disengaged by the lever on the back of the seat. Now the headrest is able to move up and down. While forward facing, the harness needs to be in the closest slot to the child's shoulders. This is no more than 2.5 centimeters above or below. While rear facing, the harness must be at or above the shoulders in the closest slot. As you can see, the harness is currently in this slot here. We need to move the headrest up to line up with the hole at the top. We need to engage the headrest so it doesn't move and then we need to remove the harness from the splitter plate so that we can move it up the next slot. Make sure you, when you're doing this, you don't have any twists in the harness or in the tightening strap down the bottom. Pull the harness back to the front of the seat, then place it back through the hole that you need it in. Please keep in mind that if you are using a zero to four year seat, you will need to re-thread the harness up and over the bar before reattaching it to the splitter plate. Bring the splitter plate back up, ensuring that this part of the strap is not twisted. Put the harness back on the splitter plate and ensure that it all looks smooth. Turn the seat back around. Tighten the harness back up again. And just ensure that there have been no sneaky twists appear on the front either. You can see that we have this seat threaded correctly because the harness, the headrest and the shell of the seat all line up perfectly. If you were to move this headrest down, it would be incorrect because the harness would now not be in a straight line. These type of seats do not have an easy adjust harness, so you must not move the headrest without also adjusting the harness. You must also not move the headrest to between the slots. This means that the harness will not be in the direct path. This seat is now ready to go. If you ever have any questions, please don't hesitate to contact me. I'm always happy to answer questions. These types of seats sometimes take a bit of practice, but after a while, it becomes really easy. I hope you have a fantastic day and drive safe.